Right. You are in a, and you are in a, in year ten, right? Attending uh attending a May June session, right? Yes. Perfect. 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 Um, All right. Well, thank you, thank you, and here we have uh, uh, Omar. Omar? Omar. Opa, opa, الناس اللي بتسكت من أولها دي. All right, all right, Malak. And um, hello. Yes, Malak, how are you, young lady? I'm good, thank you. Good, um, perfect. I can't. Perfect, all right. Uh, well, you are also year 10 OL, Cambridge, right? Yeah. May, June. Yeah. Perfect, perfect. And uh, uh, your code is 0510 or 11 or 993. Um, one second, I check that. All right. All right. And please uh, check if it uh, if it includes speaking or not. Because this is an important uh, question, please. Okay. All right. Uh, Sama. Yeah. Yes, Sama, how are you? Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, also, year 10 or L, yeah. May, June? Yes. Perfect. Perfect. And uh, uh, your code, factor of code, Bitek? Well, uh, no, I'm not sure. You're not sure. Okay. Uh, uh, let me ask you this. Uh, 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 what, uh, what, uh, uh, what country you are in now? In Egypt or outside? Outside. All right. Uh, in the Gulf region. Um, I, I don't know. Um, I'm in Oman. Oman. Oh yes, Gulf region. Gulf region. Yes. All right. Uh, uh, in uh, the Gulf region, some uh, ninety percent of schools uh apply for, apply for the the English as uh, uh as part of the exam. All right. Uh, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, 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 in some uh, some schools, uh, they they uh, they have speaking speaking endorsement. Means here that you will just in the, the speaking part right. in Cambridge as well, but only Oxford. So please check your code and if there is a speaking endorsement or count in speaking. All right. Please do. All right. Good. All right. Then we have uh here Shiraz Malak. And here we have oh yes, Malak. Everybody, I think uh, the same uh, uh the same person. No. No, okay. All right. So uh, yes, Malak, you are in uh also year 10, May June. Yes. Perfect. And uh, your uh, code includes speaking? I don't know my code yet, but it includes speaking. It includes speaking. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Well, uh, and let me let me begin with a brief uh, a brief uh, summary of uh, the the course. All right. Uh, the the uh, whatever your code is. What whatever your code is. Uh, 0510, 0511, uh, 0993. Uh, and uh, whether you have speaking or not, the good news is that is that reading, writing, and listening are the same. The, these three uh, the, uh, papers or three sections, reading and writing, which is paper one, all right? And uh, and uh, uh, the listening, which is paper two, the second paper, Yanni. All right. Uh, these three, these three skills or these two papers are the same. Okay. And the speaking, the speaking, is also the same. The difference is in the weight. 
يعني بيبر مثلا عليها 70% انذر وان الثانيه تبقى 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 30% بيبر عليها 60% انذر وان تبقى 40% اند ذات سيت رايت بس جنرالي ذا سيم اكزام ذا سيم اكزام اوف ذا ثري كودز ذا ويت از ديفرنت ذات سيت ذس از وان نمبر 2 اي شير ذا بلان اي شير ذا بلان اون ذا جروب اول رايت اوف كورس ذس بلان ويل بي ادجستد بيزد اون ذا سبيكينج based on the speaking. In this plan, we have we have the 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 uh, uh, the times uh, of quizzes. All right, the times of quizzes. It means here every every two weeks we have a quiz. This quiz, of course, includes the grammar, uh, uh, vocab, vocab one, and the skill we studied for two weeks. Yeah, any exercise one, for example, applies three or four skills. We are going to study them, practice them, answer classified. All right, fellas. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened. All right. So here, uh, as for the plan, as for the plan includes what will what, what will be done in day one, in day two, and so on till the end of the year. All right. Of course, based on the uh, uh because here, of course, some people have uh speaking or might have speaking. This plan will be adjusted to include the speaking, the speaking one. All right. Don't worry. Now, uh, shall we begin our uh? session yes all right now uh yes here we go yes all right now uh if uh, if we show together or if we see together here a past paper a past paper we are going to yes here yes here Yes. <clears throat> I bet you can see it. All right. I bet you can see it. this is this is uh, a past paper. A past paper comes up uh, comes in May June May June twenty twenty two. And in order to understand the cover page, the cover page, we have here two important words or some words. We have here, it is paper two. Okay, paper two, it means here extended. Yeah, mister, what does paper one or where, where is paper one? Paper one is the core in year nine, the pre-IG, all right? عشان كده هنلاقي لو فتحنا يعني لو فتحتوا كل نفس الامتحان ده نفس الامتحان ده but 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 the core one you will see paper one core that's it and we are studying here paper two extended extended means extra questions will be added to 
to the core exam. In addition, we have here the code 0510. 0511 or 0993 all right 993 this is the code but what if what is this 21 21 here the number two means paper two and number one means version one version one all right it means here every year or every session cambridge provides three versions or three variants three variants uh, with the same level of difficulty, with the same, uh, it it applies the same tiers, the same technique of questioning the candidates and these things. But they just distribute uh, the papers all over the countries. Yeah, and if uh, it is all the same. Now, uh, so again, twenty one is paper two, variant one. All right, and here is May June twenty twenty two. Let's talk in in twenty twenty four. Inshallah. Now. The, the the exercise one exercise one is a reading is a reading exercise all right uh here we have a text an article and then we have the questions if you take a look at those questions they are they are uh eight questions eight questions out of 13 marks it means here that here we have for example here, a question that includes four details, four details, and this applies the technique of implicit or infer, or what do you understand between the lines? Another question, another question that that is two marks here, explicit, explicit. It means here what is clearly stated in the text. So again. In exercise one, we learn together two main two main uh, skills: explicit what is directly stated in the text, and implicit what is indirectly stated in the text. Of course, there is another skill which is which is the the keywords. <coughs> Sorry, the keywords the keywords are the words that guide us to the to the answer in the text. Mr. Anna Bagibel keywords the admin. I have keywords in the question. Then I draw uh, word map. So by this, my 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 vocabulary bank or my word bank increases. Mr. Alright, Mr. Shall I depend on my background? Yes, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, we depend on our background. All right, information. Like if I'm also doing it here, if 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 I have the knowledge, the background, I have, okay. If I'm doing it, I'm just the the vocab, I'm doing the things all that. I mean, we're going to learn about how to focus in a certain point, on a certain point. So if I don't have the background, this is my job to explain and re-explain. This is my job. All right. So don't worry about this. Type your mister. What is what is following? Following is exercise two. Exercise two is something called multiple matching. Multiple matching. Here we have in the extended, we have here four or five paragraphs, and we have 10 sentences or 10 questions, and we need to match, we need to match the information in the text or in the paragraph to the question. That's it. Depending, of course, on the keywords, implicit, infer, and opinions, and the difference between facts and opinions, and how to express them and understand them. Mr. What comes after that is exercise three, which is the note taking. Note taking a text, whatever, whatever its type, persuasive, argumentative, informative, any type of these texts, and we have to select certain points in the in the text we need to select just these points whatever the and how many points but based on the number we can see here we have five it means here we have five points four means we have four points to be understood all right this is clear this is clear so it is easy yes sir yes it is 
kind of easy yes now then we have exercise four and here we have good news exercise four is is summary summary it means here the same text the same text and we need to summarize it to summarize it taban based on based on the question itself how to pick out the answer and how to rephrase them in order to deliver the same ideas and the good news is that this question is cancelled this question is cancelled and it has been replaced by a multiple choice question this is the good news all right and we are working on the notes of this and how to how to train our candidates regarding this particular question what comes after that is the white tape. Come on, as we know, we have two types of white tapes. We have informal email and formal writing. The informal and formal, this is actually the, the main the main course or what we actually see is how to write an informal email and how to deliver or to fulfill the requirements. Applying, of course, how a particular map lab, all right, the format, the layout, the audience, and the purpose of my writing, and of course, how to to write a full answer of these points, how to cover them. In addition, or finally, the article. The article here is uh, the one has many types. We have article general and article giving your views or we have reports or we have the view so each type which i feel that is that he gives up all right that can happen throughout the whole year we we study all the the, the formal and the informal writing types and all right, till we we manage how to write professionally. Right. Uh, as for as for the as for the uh the quiz uh, the the exercises, what how we are going to manage them. If you have a common snap and work common into snap we can under the kita haga snack classified and and these classified exercises already come from Past papers. So I am going to have a ten classified. Okay, I am going ten past papers. Yeah, exercise one, see ten classified. All right, we have some examples. Taba. Each classified sheet has two exercises. If I am going to have twenty past papers, I will exercise one. Then. No, push out exercise two and hell it 10, 10 classified. Well, the classified feed two exercises. I mean, in exercise two, you're gonna have 20 classified, yeah, and 20 past papers. All right, uh, well, do you have any question before I begin uh, the first, the first uh, exercise, exercise one? Sir, um, my code's zero five zero zero, but you didn't mention it. Is that still applicable? I can still um, like zero five zero zero. Yeah. Are you first language or second? First language. Okay, so this is uh, first language Cambridge. No, this is not our code. Zero five zero zero. This is first language. Let's say I G first language. Yeah, I should be yeah, UAE. All right, so it's a second language. How do you get the moment? Each first language for you. No, for my school, um, we all have to take first language. First language, wow. Yeah. Wow. Okay. This is this is uh, this is something. We need to consider something we need to consider. So zero five zero zero. This is first language. No. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. 
maybe okay. there is yeah I never thought about yeah I mean yeah I mean, there is another teacher who also teaches first language but I don't teach first language unfortunately unfortunately oh okay right. thank you oh, That's fine. thank you very much thank you very much thank you all right uh uh well let's uh, uh does anybody here have a uh, question Oxford. regarding and, oh yes sir please go ahead not i'm sorry yes i'm in oxford not cambridge okay oxford well as for oxford we we begin the year we begin the year together okay we start the year we finish uh certain uh, the basics and these things then then we split them. Then I even been further about the team between that the Bosman assistant at Oxford, or, uh, uh, Oxford or Cambridge class, because it is the same basis. Then at a certain time of the year, then we, we, we divide the group into two parts Cambridge Wahdu, Oxford Wahdu, we need the Hanakas papers, we need the Hanakas papers, and these things. But the same techniques. Okay. The same techniques. Okay. Don't worry. Hmm. Questions? Sana? Right, you're off. All right. All right. Perfect. So let's begin. Let's begin with the with the uh with question number one or exercise number one the very short orientation about it here we go yes. all right now uh take a look please at at here in in any in any exercise as in any exam any text any reading text there are there are steps of of reading this text do i have to read every single word do i have to read every single word in the text yes sir i have to read every single word will this affect affect my time unfortunately yes so what is the solution the solution here is to to spot to spot some points to spot some points in any text at any text mister what are those points those points or those highlights what do i highlight i highlight of course any text for dunya has a title has a title so i need to read it some other some other texts have something called head uh, headline uh, headlines headlines all right or the subtitle uh, uh, the subheading <clears throat> the subheading the subheading for its name it is a shorter title on the left of the page, exactly like I had shoot Dilwati, this one, this one. This text, this text has, has no title, but it has some subheadings. These are the subheadings we are talking about. They are, they are, a phrase, a phrase, it is not a complete sentence, that, that introduces what's after it. So obviously, the paragraph or the text below this sub subheading discusses what is there only. It doesn't provide any additional information about any topic. So far, so good. Ladies? Yes. Ladies, yes. All right. So this is number one. Number two, 
what else do I spot in any text? I will never show forget it. If there is a picture, and this thing is there in Oxford and Cambridge, by the way, a picture. I need to see the picture, whether it is a map, a graph, just a picture of even some people. And I need to read the captions or the words or the description of this picture. Some photos. These are called, these words are called captions. We need to check them. Why? In order to get the general idea or to get the gist of the, the, the whole topic. Yani, if I ask you this, from the first look on this text in front of you, what does it talk about? Hmm. Girl is well, let me ask. Given uh, another name, given another, another. All right, another. What does it mean? It means that we have two names. One is original and the other one is another, another one. To what period? To what period? 21st century, not 19th, not 20th, not 18th. It is just for the 21st century. طب يا مستر انت مرخم قوي ليه في موضوع الكي ووردز؟ تعالوا اقول لكم انا برخم ليه في موضوع الكي ووردز. As we spot here these key words نيجي بقى بالازرق كده. Here we have this is a keyword هطلع بعناية فوق هلاقي اهي. So my answer is in this part. Then name انا قبل ما اقرا questions before I read the questions, and already I highlighted names. It is a name, name, capital letter. I see the capital letters that I have highlighted in the part of this. I'm going to go This. And this. These are the two highlighted names or two highlighted capital letters, phrases, Taban. So the answer is there in this paragraph. It is either Internet of Things or Digital Age. Tabia, Mr. Okay, how do I decide which answer is correct? Hinaba, I read the entire sentence Elifiha. So here we have, I just read the sentence and the sentence. Yalla, read and tell me what is another name given to this period. Yes, uh, Shiraz. Digital age. Digital age. And I'm going to say that it's right or wrong. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, Sama, what do you think? Is Shiraz correct? Yes, I think she's correct. Yes, I think she's correct. All right. Malak, do you think Shiraz and Sama correct? Okay. Yes, ladies, you are totally correct. Excellent. Excellent. So it is digital age. Tabia, Mr. 
معلش ولكن هنتاكد برضو ازاي اجان لازم اعيد يس اكسن ديجيتال اي جي اس ار اول رايت طب يا مستر هتاكد تاني تعالي اولا ات از نيم ثانك يو نيم كابيتال ليتر جيفن 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 so it is called all right and the same period yes and what is another name hamid bae to confirm oppositely all right the opposite side tab ana hena mehtar bin the internet of things i read we are seeing the beginning of driverless cars and the internet of things smart uh, household devices that can be controlled remotely from a phone or blah 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 so this is not an age This is not a period. That's it. Is it easy, girls? Huh. Yes, sir. Yes, ladies. All right. The second question, B. When was the computer mouse first seen in public? Type. And I know that you know the answer. And I know that it's a very difficult one. But to up. Sorry, to apply the skill. Apply the skill. First seen in public. This is the key word. In addition, here computer mouse. I'll put it on computer mouse. 100%. When I need a time. And here I have two times. Here I have two times. This one and this one. I need a definite answer. Dabia Mr. Seen in public. This is the keyword. Hmm. What is a, an alternative in this part? Fihin alternative Lemana Kilmit first seen in public. Or seen in public. Huh. There is an alternative synonym. Another meaning, another word. Huh. Hmm. What is another word? Seen in public. All right. In public means in front of people. So it is not a secret. It is not a... Uh, a person-to-person -person discussion, so it is a conference. Seen, demonstrate. So here, this is. أكتبها بقى عندي في التابلوت بتاعتي. All right, في 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 البورت اللي بأخذ فيه notes. وأكتب كلمة demonstrate. Uh, yes, see in public means demonstrate at a, at a conference. In public conference, demonstrate seen. If I add to my vocabulary bank. So, what is the answer? 1968 or 1970? Hmm. Yes, Shiroz? 1968. 1968. Sama? It's later. Huh? I'm sorry? Um, two years later. Okay, and it bah. Okay. Tali ba nit khani hila ba 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 ba. Shwai. Or, sorry, bahe bil khani ewi. 1968, it was, yani, public debuts, all right, or first seen in public, right? <coughs> and, zayi ma'amanna, fi question number one, I read the two sentences or the one sentence. All right? Now, Here we have, here we have demonstrated at a computer conference, here demonstrate scene and these things. But look at the second sentence. It's inventor Douglas, Re research uh, uh, Douglas uh, in part of, of uh, Stanford Research Institute receives the patent for the mouse two years later. So two years later, He received the patent. What is the patent? 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 What is the patent
Barat Khtrayat. Yes. All right. Two years later. So it was there for two years. Okay. Okay. That's it. Yeah, I get it. You got it? All right. Yeah. So again and again and again. It's very important, ladies. في عندي steps كده لازم لازم أحفظها زي ما أنا حافظ اسمي هقولها لكم وأكتبها لكم كده قدامكم now I the first one number one scan the text number two number two spot or highlight the words the names بقى والنمبرز وال والبنكتويشن الحاجات اللي احنا ايه راجعنا فيها ديت ما تعدناش دلوقتي يا مستر حاضر مش عيد. All right. Number three. Check the questions. Questions اللي فيها ال keywords. Number four. Think of alternatives. Of the key words, period means time, age, like this, when, try to figure out uh, or predict the answer. Then number five, search for, search for the, uh, yani the words, the hair keywords, or alternatives in the text. زي ما شوفنا conference uh, 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 demonstrate means seen in public 21st century can it for 21st century then the last one the last uh, uh, step or, or the last point sorry oh, yes there we go the last the last point is read the sentence which include which includes the keywords or the alternatives or the synonyms. Spot the accurate answer and write it in brief. And this is this is a serious issue that people always, when they first time study uh, uh, the ESL, all right, they write the whole sentence in their answer. I'm sorry, ladies, it is absolutely wrong. Don't write the full answer, uh, the full sentence. Just خليكي بخيلة. خليكي بخيلة. Basically. بخيلة جدا. All right. The question asks about when. When. Just the time. Uh, what name given? Who a name? But to write the full sentence, then as an extra developed. I'm sorry, Manish. These are the steps how to answer exercise one. Okay, ladies. So far, so good. Yes, sir. Yes, yes. lady, go ahead, please. Hmm, question? Go ahead. No, I don't have one. Uh, okay, all right, all right. Tell you, mister. Let's see what. Tell me, I'm going to get All right. Tell me, I'm going to practice on a little bit. I'm going to send you to the group. I'm going to send you to the classified. I'm going to send you to the mister. I'm going to send you to the mister. I'm going to send you to the mister. I'm going to send you to the classified. Follow. Please check the group now. Go ahead. Go ahead. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, yani for your uh information, kida da hai a shakli classified hai classified hai gen hai a kida. All right. What on four pages? Uh, text to question, text to question. I can fight it. I can't do many. 
it means that classified one في two exercises هنحل واحد مع بعض together والتاني هتحلوه in the in the session بعد كده بقى هناخد homework تاخدي بقى انت ونصيبك بقى Hello? Yes. Oh, yes, ladies. Now, uh, let's let's see here. Let's sir, see here. Sir. Yes, go ahead, please. Sir, did you you did you send it in the group? Because I don't think I'm in it. I didn't get anything. Yes, Salam. All right. Let me send it back in the group of uh the chat of Zoom. Salam. There you go. Tfadlani. Let's go ahead. Here you go. Please receive it. Uh, yes, here. Yes, go ahead. Um, can you send it to me too? Right? Yes. Thank you, sir. Uh, share the screen with you in order to answer it together. Yo, here we have, here we have the text. It is a cool text. It's about trick ship of here we don't have subheadings and the national anawin is but we have a title, a picture, Wuma and Dinash Capture. Yol. Wuma and Dinash Capture. Yo, you have one minute, one minute to scan it very quickly. Yo. <clears throat> Mm, done? Yes. All right. Uh, together, together. All right. Here we have uh, one, two, uh, here, three, here. These are the things we spot.
I asked Phyllis, sorry. So here, this is the, the thing we are discussing here. Now, after we finish this, we go to the questions. When the ship sank, how much gold might it have been carrying? The key words. When the ship sank Khalas already, how much how much we need money number? All right. We need a number of certain amount of money. All right. And how much a command gold, not uh, any other thing. Yani not silver, not pots, just gold. Tabia Mister, let's see. Huh. What is the answer? How much? We need a number. Hmm. Ladies? Oh, yes, Summer, please. Tons? Ten tons. Perfect. Ten tons. Matalash about a month money. Excellent. Matalash money. Excellent. So here, 10 tons. 10 tons. Excellent. You are correct. Tabia, mister, do I write up to 10 tons or just 10 tons? Both are correct. Both are correct. Tabia, mister, let's see this. The second question. Uh, what was the purpose of the ship's journey in 16... 94. What was the purpose? And this is the year. 19, uh, 1694. The purpose. Yalla, mister. Purpose. Fidmehi. The key word means. Purpose. Reason. How to express a purpose. In order to. To. Because of these are words and phrases to express purpose. Hmm. Can you pick up the answer in my in sixteen ninety four? Yes, uh, Shiroz. Hmm. It was on a secret mission to take gold and silver to finance an ally in war. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sama, what do you think? The same answer? Yeah. Malak, the same answer? Malak. Hmm. All right, Malak. Yes, ladies, correct. Thank you very much. So here, here is a secret mission taking a gold and silver to finance an LA in war. All right. Tabia, mister, do I have to write the full sentence? No. So here, simply taking gold and silver to finance an LA in war. Perfect. So this is the purpose. Perfect, perfect, perfect. All right. Uh, the following question is, what is today's value of the content of the ship? Today's value means here, money, value, money. Huh. Yes, Summer? Five billion pounds. Okay. Shiroz? Huh. 2.5 billion euros. Excellent, 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 excellent. Both are correct. Excellent. Bravo, Ali. dollars. Excellent. Thank you. And I'm fine. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So, here, how much the value, as you said, as you said, here we have. 
in the previous phrase we 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 spotted these two two numbers <laughs> value money all right but how do we know how do we know as you said as you said uh, i'm sorry as you already did that you read the whole sentence recently and you can admit today in the question it means recently perfect 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 but this one uh -huh, this is the project this is the project the exploration all right perfect 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 allah alaikum allah alaikum now uh question d to whom will the gold really belong if the marine exploration firm can salvage it to whom to whom it will belong hmm. Salvage it, difficult word I know. So simply we can search for this word. Ah, did you find it? Yes, uh, Shiroz. It would belong to the state. It will belong to the state. Okay, what do you think?